Hey, I'm Albert from Muffin Group and from now on I will be making a video tutorials about the Bee Theme and the Bee Builder. If you have any feedback about this video or just want me to make a tutorial about something you don't know how to use, feel free to leave me a comment and I will do my best to help you. Ok, so let's move on to the topic. In this tutorial I would like to focus on Content Overlay option uh, which is located in the header options. Uh, so this option is available basically when you create or edit existing header and uh, I'm going to show you how it exactly works because we've recently uh, got some questions about this option and I thought it might be way, way much easier to explain it on the video. So uh, the first option is default and now if we uh, generate the preview uh, you will see that when we open the sub menu, in this case it's mega menu, nothing is happening. The menu just pops up and that's it. Uh, if we go back to the builder and if we switch to blur, we have two options. The first option is overlay color. It's the color you can set and uh, we use the uh, RGBA color uh, to make it transparent. Uh, it, it depends on you how uh, tr what transparency you would like to use and the other field is blur um, it tells you uh, how much the content which is uh, underneath the header uh, is blurred so um, let's say I will leave the overlay color uh, which is kind of black but with 0 0.45 transparency and the blur of 10 and if I will generate the preview right now and hover over the menu item you will see that the content which is uh, behind the mega menu uh, has blurred and got some kind of opacity okay if we go back to the uh, builder uh, we have two other options the next one is gray out uh, as soon as we click the generate preview we will see that the content which is behind the mega menu uh, just grayed out and that's it there is no extra options uh, let's go back to the builder and the last one is overlay and this one just uh, got an option where you can set an overlay color uh, let's say you want a little bit different color like maybe a bit uh, kind of yellow or green and as soon as I will generate the preview and hover over the menu item you will see that the content uh, has been overlaid with the color we've just set and that's basically it this is what this option is for uh, it's great for mega menus but not, not only you can use it also for just the regular uh, menu items that is all for this video, thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. If you have more questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.